let the melting mountains grow. Let the evening ponds flow. Take your cocoa, take the mumble from the jungle. Beat them bum from the cocoa with some lump into their mouth. What an ego, what an amigo, Mr. Jango. Drink your tango, not fandango. Let the grown boy grow. Oh, let the sun down so. In your soul, sunshine to what grow. It is both stick and stone. Still stand stubborn. Never a joke, whether I smoke, not a joke, like a player in a book. Mix it with posters, who are plotted, but I'm with butter, that was a shot, just like matter, which is clutter, with some platter, put on a platter, not with latter, with some fighter. Not your fault, that we carry, not we carry, I'm very, very, when we carry, what we carry from. Mr. Jerry, why contrary to declare it? Not accept why it may be elected. Let the evil puns blow. Still stand stubborn. According to some modern day politicians, with quite a large number of other members of the public and their little. That multiculturalism is a modern day phenomenon. A lot of these commonalities were and are still being developed based on this period of secession. Unbeknown does not equate non existence. In most universities, by a few, black history is not in a worthy place as a cause. In its own right, Sister to man to deny itself. Ramesses Productions presents The Rhyme Factory and Okay. 
it. You don't think they'll pay detailed attention to features? Oh no. On pictures, what a thousand words. So, let's see how true that really is. Prehistoric Times by James Anderson, 1911 AD. I quote The first inhabitants of southern Europe, northern Africa, Arabia, France, and British islands were a race of small men who did not average in height more than four feet five inches. They were of slight guilt with dark complexions. They were an African people. And of course, the climate were not okay, yo. Now I run in that go. is so new that my teachers and professors don't know about it yet. Well, yes, some teachers and professors genuinely do not know about this. So it might be comforting to believe that those that know are sufficient characters that they will not lie to you. The facts do not support that conclusion. And for those teachers and professors, who did tell the truth, the truth had their work suppressed. For those teachers and professors who genuinely do not know have been very poorly educated about black history in maintaining the status quo. However, without the excellent researches done by many eminent occasion scientists past and present, we will have little or no evidence. Thank you. The Rhyme Buster. Clattering my time with your chronic gears. Spinning our spirit in spiral and spook. Erroneous history, mystery. Scripture said, the risk. On the lips of growth, Iscariot, the Judas, the Jackson. Jiggling and jogging and I guess the king. Humpty Dumpty, Mr. Chomsky, 
very flimsy, they be clumsy, and we get hungry, and be young, they keep mouthy, pop their rooms, into their movie, all the students, and be bound, and the power, but cheap monsters, and be around, from be bound, with the madness, who are fosters, looking at rocks, and go mind,
able Celtic scholar, Professor Rice, has set forth the theory that the dwarf race inhabited Britain previous to the Celtic invasion. And these views has generally been accepted among scholars. H2H2, second paragraph. As for fairies, they are not the dethroned gods of the heathen self, nor were they the spirits of unbaptized children or of Greeks who had rejected Christianity. But they were originally dwarfs and pygmies similar to biscuits. They were actually killed in Wales. Page 282, the second paragraph. Cornwall then was in the early days of Neolithic age, inhabited by a race of pygmies like the Bushmen of South Africa. And for whom, for convenience, I shall call the Bisky Dwarfs. Page 282. Third paragraph. Mr. M. de Montenet figured out the diminutive half an inch arrowheads were found in France, Kitchen Living, Instance, England, and Reverend Reginald Gatti found like numbers of them in Yorkshire, England, including Germany. In the temple, 
on the mantle in the apple, laced with me, awesome stable, terrible, sample, not quite apple. Those who deny self are born again right to self, enveloped in the darkness, utterly devoid of love for the Lord. The self is one ever still. The self is swifter than thought, swifter than senses. Though motionless, it outruns all pursuit. Without self, never could life exist. The self seems to move, but is ever still. He seems far away, but is ever there. He is within all, and it transcends all.
Mr. Clarke, who is in London? Mr. Clarke, who is in London? What on like? Lick him a lucky. Mr. Clarke, who is in London? What on like? Lick him a lucky. Not Iraq, thinking of black. For the point, in his lunch, and the terrible. Mr. Clarke, who is in London? What on like, licking the lackeys, not the rack, snitching on black, for the crunch, in his lunch, and did the terrible, black in the predator, make him the vision, not so invisible, keep him the rascal. Mr. Clark, who is the lack, what on like, licking the lackeys, not the rack, snitching on black, for the crunch, in his lunch. And did the terrible, black in the predator, make him divisible, not so invisible, keep him invisible, not so traversable, maybe detectable, that's quite advisable. 